What's up, my peoples? This is Rob of Wise Life, giving honor, esteem, prestige, and majesty to Yahuwah only. All right, he's the only one I serve. All right, you guys see the, the title of the, of the video, so we're going to get right into it. Uh, let's go to Zephaniah 2 and 3. Zephaniah 2 and 3. I'll be reading uh, from my Tanakh Safari app. All right. Verse 3. It says, Seek Yahuwah, all you humble of the land who have fulfilled his law. Seek righteousness. Seek humility. Perhaps you will find shelter on the day of Yahuwah's anger. All right. And that day is, is rapidly approaching. All right. So you guys, like I said, you see the title of the video. Uh. This video is called Public, and I'm fixed to make a few things public today, all right? I've made a lot, a lot of my belief public, but it's a lot of subliminal stuff that's been going on. Some stuff need to come to the light so people can, can get an understand, a, a understanding of who they're dealing with, all right? So, uh, first off, uh, I, and I'm reading, my, I'm reading off my notes here so y'all know that I'm reading off my notes. You know what I'm saying? I ain't, ain't no shame in my game. I had a lot to say. I had a lot I've been thinking about uh, the last several days, of how I wanted to do this. Today just happened to be the day, and, and I, I got the notes and the verses for it. So uh, first I want to say to all the seekers out there, all you lights that's, that's seeking the truth, that want uh, a relationship with the Most High, all right? And you're trying to come out of idolatry, trying to come out of sin, uh, the self-sabotage you've done to yourself, all the different mistakes you've made, all right? I hope my videos, all right, can be um, helpful. Hopefully, my videos can be of some service, some real service to you, all right, as you continue to seek the Father uh, alone, all right? And if you don't mind, please like the video so we can we can get, get it moving in the algorithm, all right? Because I do want my subscriptions to go up. That means I'm being effective. All right. That means I am helping people. All right. Especially since I'm passionate about not being in idolatry. All right. Uh, also, if you would share the video. All right. Uh, so more seekers of truth and, and, and uh, vessels of light can hear the message and have an opportunity to seek for Yahuwah for themselves. All right. And then lastly, uh, if you rocking with me, subscribe. All right. Just just uh, hit that subscribe button and, and let's take this this last day's journey together. You know what I'm saying? If you if you hear the troll, if you hear if you ain't rolling, if you ain't rocking, hey, keep it moving because I'm a delete. I'm deleting your stuff. All right. If you if you ain't here to add uh, positive energy or add uh, a honest discussion i mean you might you might disagree with me and it's an honest disagreement and we can have some some good dialogue behind it if you just here to be crazy and and ignorant i'm 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 shutting all that down you get no love over here with that stuff all right so like i said today i'm gonna make a few things public all right and uh servant jensen this is for you all right uh ecclesiastes 716. Let's go to Ecclesiastes 716. All right. Let's see. You know what? I want that one out of my. There it is. Ecclesiastes 716 in the KJV. It says, be not righteous over much, neither make thyself over wise. Why shouldest thou destroy thyself? Jensen, you the one that's overly righteous right now. All right. You, you coming out with all these subliminal messages talking about you going, if you get spoken about in public, you're going to respond in public. Bro, you ain't even said my name. You ain't said Mike's name. You ain't said uh, words of the Ruach name. You do, you want to do all this stuff? Uh, you you want to you want a uh, fingernail box, bro? Put the gloves on. If you got something to say, say it. If you disprove, disprove, and and tell the people who you're talking about. 
It, it don't make no, no sense to you, for you to say public and don't make it public. I disagree with that. If you're going to make something public, make it public. I, I decided to make it public. You know what I'm saying? So uh, what I see is some ego and some bitterness over there, man. That's real talk. You need you you might need therapy or something. I don't know. But I I I mean, why are we the only ones you going at? You ain't talking tough to nobody else. I mean, you ain't you ain't you ain't ready to, to throw blows with nobody else except for us. We all of a sudden we the ones that that got the target on our back by y'all. It it don't make no sense. So but but I agree with you on something. I do agree with you on vetting. You you said uh, you made a statement in, in your latest video or one of your latest videos about vetting. We do need to vet people in 2022 and beyond. Has to happen. We we just we figured that out after messing with y'all <laughs> that we had to start vetting people. We had to 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 actually roll up the sleeves and start doing some of the work to learn learn who people are. You know what I'm saying? When 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 the father sent uh, Gideon to war, the father cut his army down till there was just 300 left. 300 people that he knew would help Gideon get the job done. That wasn't afraid. That wasn't that wasn't gonna gonna dodge no wrecks or nothing. So, at the end of the day, you gotta vet people to see if they gonna ride with you and rock with you. Through thick and thin. Let, let's let's make our, some of our vetting process public. You and I did have conversations about the All Star Game. You should have told people that. Come on, bro. Ain't nothing wrong with telling people that you was you was uh, honestly trying to make a link with somebody. There's nothing wrong with that. You and I did have some genuine conversations, and we tried to link, and it just didn't work out. All right, I said what I said, and then I moved on. I, man, I unsubscribed from y'all, and I wasn't even trying to, trying to, you know, do nothing with y'all. But then I go back over there and look, or I get videos sent to me where y'all taking shots, sneak dissing. I did a whole song about sneak dissing, man. What don't you know? I don't like sneak dissing. I don't sneak diss people. At least I don't try to. Something might slip out every now and then because I'm human, but. Look, I'm not trying. If I got a if I got beef with you, I'm gonna say I got beef with you. And I I was I was done. I done moved on from you guys, and and now all of a sudden y'all just keep with these slick little shots, these little Christian shots, because that's what Christians do. That stuff happened to me in the church. Every church I went to, some stuff like this happened. Why you think I left them, bruh? You acting just like they do. All you did was change the names and the melanin. Of the guy that you follow. You know, that guy that, that uh, they used to conquer the world to kill millions of people. That religion. Yeah. It's crazy, man. And then then uh, when y'all met up with Frank, them, y'all didn't want to take pictures and stuff. When y'all went and had burgers or, or hot dogs or whatever it is y'all y'all said y'all had with them. Y'all didn't want to take pictures because y'all didn't want to be seen with a, it. It was like, you know, we we, you know, contaminated or something. And all the while, I was the main one behind the scenes trying to link all the Yahushua ministries. I was the one doing that. Y'all wasn't doing it. Took y'all a while to even get my to respond back. Let's make that public. Stuff is crazy, man. We was the one trying to link up all the all the ministries. That's why we've we've fallen out with so many different people when we saw what they were standing on. Some of the stuff that they we was trying we was trying to move all the way to the truth. We I wasn't I was trying to leave Christianity behind me. I wasn't trying to pull Christianity in there with me. That ain't what we doing. But we see that's what a lot of y'all do. Super Christians. Change the name and the skin tone. Keep keep a lot of the same doctrines. A lot of the same beliefs. All it is is Catholicism 2.0, 3.0. Like I said, it's crazy. Zechariah 8. Let's go to Zechariah 8. Let 
I'm going to read this one from the KJV as well. Zechariah 8, verses 16 and 17. These are the things that ye shall do. Speak ye every man the truth to his neighbor. Execute the judgment of truth and peace in your gates. And let none of you imagine evil in your hearts against his neighbor and love no false oath. For all these are things that I hate, saith Yahuwah. Now, let's make public why we moved away from y'all. Why Rob moved away from Jensen. All right. When I was getting attacked by that other ministry. All right. You and your elder both agreed that they what they was doing was wrong. Y'all both agreed. it, But you wouldn't say nothing on it. All right. But the word is telling us to speak in judgment against unrighteousness. Y'all knew I was trying to link up all the ministries. But that ministry and other other ministries, other people did not want to link. And I, that was cool. All they had to do was say, look, we we, you know, we understand what y'all doing. We, you know, we admire y'all, y'all uh, position and, and wanting to, to link with us at this time. though, we don't have any interest. That's all you had to say. That's all they had to say. That's all anybody had to say. And we'd, we'd have just kept it rocking. But we knew some 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 foul stuff was, was going on. And then when that stuff happened to us and we started calling it out, y'all wouldn't y'all didn't want to speak on it. And you can't use your remarriage as a reason of why you didn't speak on it, bro. It don't work like that. The, the things that are the most high always uh, come first. You can't pick and choose when you're going gonna to put the most high priorities in front. We can't do that. My next note. All right. All right. So you, so Jensen, servant, you hardcore on this Neanderthal thing. And I, I just, <laughs> I don't know why. We didn't create that evidence. We didn't, we didn't do the science. We didn't do the testing. All right. Mike did a video and and man that thing y'all y'all went ballistic. Taking what he's saying out, out of context. It man very emotional. You use the word emotional a lot. Emotions and emotional. You use that word uh a lot. But then here you go. You I mean you keep bringing up Neanderthal. Did, look, the 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 information is there. People can go look and see what the scientists have said. Uh, Neanderthal DNA is is connected to. All right, there are certain haplogroups out there that do not have uh, Neanderthal uh, DNA. Them is just the facts, man. We we searching for true answers and true information, man. Stuff that makes all this stuff make sense. I I don't I don't understand. I, I don't I don't get why you why you still so pressed on that. Is, is it a racial thing with you? I don't know, servant. Anyway, I mean, we live in a day and age where where censorship is is prevalent and and emotional prejudice, uh, emotional prejudice, is uh, running rampant. So, if if a man can't say what his his American, so-called American uh, freedom of speech uh, laws allow him to say, without people uh, disagreeing the right way. Just like you said, unity and, and fellowship has to be done the right way. You need to learn how to disagree the right way. You want to disagree and use words that will get people censored. Wanting to bring racism and racial stuff into it. I think I think you're trying to project your feelings on us. Your elder need to correct you on that because he know who the people is. And speaking of that, let's get into that. Here's the big stickler for me when it come to you, Jensen. You you all over this Neanderthal thing. Well, I'm all over this Israel thing. Who's the real Israel? Answer me that. 
Let's make that public. Will you make that public? You said you go, if, if if something happens publicly, you're gonna respond publicly. Will you respond to that and say who the real who you who you think the real Israel is? So we can have that on record. You know who I think the real Israel is. I think I think it's blacks over here in America and in the UK and in the Caribbean islands. And and also scattered all throughout uh, the earth. I think it's the son of Ham, uh, the descendants of, of Shem, not Ham. I, I think Ham uh, dominates Africa, but, but Shem is a part of Africa too. But some of Shem got sent to the States and to the UK and to the Caribbean islands. And, and, and to the Southern Americas. We're everywhere. I admit it. Will you admit it? And how do I know? Deuteronomy 28. Let's go to Deuteronomy 28. Everybody say we always run into Deuteronomy 28. Well, I mean, that's where the facts is, right? <laughs> Starting at verse 45. Moreover, all these curses shall come upon thee and shall pursue thee and overtake thee till thou be destroyed because thou hearkenest not unto the voice of Yahuwah thy mighty one to keep his commandments and his statutes which he commanded thee. And they shall be upon thee for a sign and a wonder and upon thy seed forever. That's why I think we the people because blacks have gone through more than anybody. You can agree or disagree. I just want I want to I want you to publicly state your opinion on it. Publicly, like you said. Let's make it public. You also talked about reputation. Well, I just I simply disagree with you on reputation. You said your reputation don't matter to you. Well, me, my reputation matters to me. Because I want to have a good name. The word says the steps of a good man are ordered by Yahuwah. Reputation is attached to that. All right. So I, I, just, I disagree with you when you say you don't you don't care about your reputation. That's why you don't put your name on stuff. All you showing is your face. You ain't told the people what your name is. I'm, I know your first name. I forgot your last name. Like I said, I put y'all in the rearview mirror. Y'all kept attacking us. Well, the world knows your name by Jensen now. They know my name is Rob. So, I mean, what, what's wrong? Tell them who you are, man. So you can serve the people. You say you're serving a Yah. A servant serves the people for Yah. Serving a Yahuwah serves the people. And he called Israel his servant. Let's see here. Almost done with my notes. There you are. All right. So. You saying that you're going to address stuff publicly is really not what you've been doing. Your last several videos has not been public because you ain't been telling the people nothing. Your monologue. You ain't said nothing. You ain't you ain't said who you talking to and who you talking about. You ain't made it public. Makes no sense. You also said you was going to boldly proclaim the gospel. Well, brother, I suggest that you do that. Because obviously you Christian to the core. You are hard. You if they would have never changed the names, you would have been just fine. You would have fit right in. I told you I'm not a Christian no more. I moved away from that stuff. All right. My my duty now is to seek the seekers, to go after the remnant. That's what I'm trying to do. I ain't trying to, to get nobody else off course. I ain't trying to be in nobody else's business. All I want to do is, is present facts to people and, and let them determine what who they're going to choose. The most high or continue staying in they self, uh, they self 
uh, ignorance. They self-sabotage. That's what I was trying to say. But ignorance fits. Over here is Yahuwah alone, Jensen. Y'all can y'all keep doing it. You ain't got to use our videos and our content to keep y'all message going. Y'all got plenty. I mean, get 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 tell the people about the church fathers. That's what other ministries started doing. It's plenty that y'all can still get into to, to keep the people warped and confused. I'm trying to wake the lights up, man. Because the father ain't coming until Israel, until he come for Israel. And people have to join and become Israel. Because that's what the words say. The father already made provisions. Everybody he going to save, you know what I'm saying? It, it, the provisions have already been made for. And it ain't no church. The church cannot steal our identity no more. With guys like me on the scene. And when I'm gone, it's going to be guys behind me that's coming. That's telling people, do uh, the church can't steal our identity, all right? The salvistic son of the New Testament can't steal our identity, all right? The Middle, East, the Middle Easterners that's over there right now can't steal our identity, all right? We got to figure out who we are. I'm trying to wake up the people that don't know who they are. And so they have a, 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 a opportunity to choose Yahuwah or Bust. And you just in the way. Lastly, Jensen, it's the most high that's weaving this all together, man. So, so if y'all y'all can do what you want on this. I know you're going to do what you want on this. You your own man. Do what you want. All right. It, it's it's all good. I'm not a scholar. I'm not a debater. I'm not a priest. Uh, I'm not I'm not a teacher. I'm not. Uh, a prophet. I'm none of those things. I'm just a light trying to shine his light in this darkness. To all of those of y'all who rocking with me and you looking for Yahuwah for yourself. Thank you. And keep looking, keep searching, keep grasping on to him and his principles only. Align yourself with him and, and continue to work this stuff out in his word. His word is the Old Testament scripture. That's real scripture. The New Testament, them is just letters and, and opinions and good advice in sections. And it can be confusing because it don't align. A lot of it don't align with the Old Testament. Seek Yahuwah only. He will show you his truth. Let me leave y'all with this one verse. Let's go to Micah 6. I'm going to read this one from the Tanakh. Micah 6 verse 8. He has told you, O oh man, what is good. And what Yahuwah requires of you only to do justice and to love goodness and to walk modestly with your mighty one. We got the blueprint. All right. We got to turn back to the most high. Once we turn back to him, he'll turn back to us. All right. He going to break these bands off of us and he going to reset this thing. All right. Jensen. It ain't personal. Just like I told your elder. It's not personal. But you keep coming for me and I'm going to keep, I'm, I'm, I'm coming for you. Matter of fact, now the energy that I'm going to use going forward, all right, I'm going to keep doing what I was doing. All right. I ain't going to, you can, you can say whatever you want about me. But unless you attack me directly or attack my family, I ain't responding else, nothing else to you. Because like I said, you just in the way. I know what I was sitting here to do now. All right. Appreciate the conversation, though, y'all. Remember, like, share, and subscribe. But first and foremost, and always,
Keep Yahuwah number one. He, he deserves that number one spot. Much love, y'all. Shalom.